everyone. Thank you for tuning in. In today's video, we are going to talk about how to embed Facebook page videos into your website using Sociable Kit and the website builder WordPress. So, first things first, we are going to the official website of the Sociable Kit, so sociablekit.com, and it will uh, redirect you in this official page of Sociable Kit. So, here we are going to sign up. So if you haven't already created your account yet, if you haven't registered at the top right of your screen, click this sign up button and you can sign up your account. And if you have already created your account, in our case, I have, al I have already created mine, we are going to click this login button. So now we are in the widget page. So to create to go to the creation of widget page, just go to the top screen, top right of your screen and click this create widget button. If you click this, it will redirect you to the creation of widget page. So in here, we're going to select our widget. So in our case, it's Facebook page videos. So we we can search for it or just scroll down. Facebook page video so here it is and I almost forgot that you have to after you, after you created your or after you selected your uh, your widget your Facebook page widget if you haven't connected your Facebook account yet in the social book kit it will appear a button here that says connect your Facebook and it will connect your Facebook and it will uh, read all your pages so I have these different kinds of pages so I think we're going to use this page so the sociable kit will base on this page this uh, name of the page and he and it will get all the uh, videos that are available in this page so that is also we're just going to click next And here we are. So sometimes it takes a lot of time to uh, load your widget your, or your feeds depending on the content of your page. So you just have to wait to sync up or you can manually sync it up and ask, uh, ask the help of, uh, from the customer service. Or sometimes it takes a min minutes, hours, or even days. So the worst case is days. So if, if it ha hasn't loaded yet or synced in yet, you can go uh, down below at the uh, or chat the customer service and they will surely help you. So in our case, it has already been loaded. So here is the videos in my page. So all of this is in the Facebook page videos. So now we're going to the creation or I mean customization and moderation tab. So at the right side or the left side of your screen, you can see these different kinds of tabs. So the basic tab, themes tab, profile tab, videos tab, and so on. So I, we were going to through this one by one. So first things first is the basic tab. So in here, you can change the name of your widget. So for example, you have to do something and not continue doing this widget you know, and you want to continue this later you can name rename your widget so you can know what widget you are working on so I'm going to put this DSM FB page videos so that is the name of my widget so in here down below in the domain you uh, we can change the URL or the website URL of this widget or page. So in our case, I think, for example, I'm going to put DSM page videos. I think that's, that's simple enough. And we're going to save changes. So now in the Facebook ID, so this is basically the ID of your page. So you can choose what page you want so in our case we're gonna stick by the posted by DSM so now in the themes tab so here are the different kinds of color theme or themes so 
each each theme has its own different kind of combination of colors so for example if you click this maganda theme you can see the colors that it will use to add to your widget so here it is as you can see it added this color scheme or color theme in this widget so you can guys find whatever theme that you like or that fits your business or website so I think this Maliwala's theme is uh, I think this fits the most because it is simple not very not uh, very color and it uh, complements the contents so I'm gonna uh, save changes and gonna keep this color theme next is the profile tab so in here are different kinds of our uh, check boxes so each here you can show or unshow your profile picture your profile name like button like count username description search box and so on so I can choose to show it or hide it so it depends on your preference if you want or what you want to display so now we're going to the videos tab so in here we can choose if we if the layout that we want to use is either grid or carousel so I think grid is again simple enough and it shows all of the videos I think this is good enough and now here we can also change the spaces between the videos and the diff and the default videos count so for examples right now there's I think 12 I think I'm going to put 6 and two columns so I think I'm gonna put three columns so three each and yeah it should only display one two three four five six six videos in three columns so now we're going to the uh, are going to see if this works so we can also click this checkbox if you want uh, if you if the if you want for your customers to if they click this video it will play on Facebook or, or it will stay on the website so here it is change six videos in three columns I think this looks more neat and simple and professional next in the video item tab so in here you can enable links or disable it you can unshow or show the post title the description and the post date so you can also change the video content padding now next in the moderation tab you can approve videos or predefine search any keywords that you want so we're gonna skip over this now in the colors tab so if you if you didn't find the color theme that fits your business or your website you can always manually change it here so you can change the color of the background you can change the color of the font the link color hover pop up background and so on so everything is manually you can change now in the font fonts tab you can change the font or the type of font family that you want to use so for example I wanted to change into Ariel so now you can also change the font size in the profile username font size so if I click save changes this should change the font family from century gothic to Arial. so here it is as you can see it, it is changed so everything is good now in the text tab you can change literally the text that says posts likes videos on Facebook load more videos search like us on Facebook and so on so it depends on you what you guys want next in the buttons tab it's the same as the colors tab you can change manually the color of your uh, button if you didn't like the any of these color themes so you can change the color of the button next in the CSS you can put your custom CSS in here so now we are all set we are now going to embed this into our website in uh, specifically WordPress so now in the top right of first screen we're going to click this embed on website button 
So now it allows us to put what website builder we want to embed this on. So in our case, it is WordPress. So we're going to click this. And it will show us the step-by-step -step process on how to embed this into your WordPress. And now we're going to follow this. So first things first, copy the following code, JavaScript code, and copy this. So now we are going to the WordPress website, this website builder, and we're going to add a new page if you want. If you want to put it in your main page or any kind of page, this is just an example. For example, your, this is a clear page of your website and you want to put your Facebook page videos in here. So first, we're going to add a title. So for example, my my website is called Shamrock. Shamrock Coffee Video uh, Incorporated, just like that. And videos, Facebook videos. Facebook videos. This is just an example. And now we're going to click this add block button. And from here, we're going to search for the custom HTML. And now from here, we're going to copy this and paste this code in the custom HTML. So that is all. Literally, that is very easy. You can also preview it, what it looks like. So here it is. Here is our uh, Facebook page videos and you can also we can also publish it so we can fully see what it's what does it look like so here it is all of the videos are in here so it is only showing six videos and all the changes that we put the font family the video count and so on so everything is in here so that is all guys and I hope you guys like this video tutorial it is very easy you just have to copy the code and choose what website builder you're going to use and literally copy it in the WordPress website so if you guys like this just like and subscribe and you can uh, uh, see all of our videos that uh, related to our tutorial different kinds of tutorial for different kinds of widget or website builder that we have and if you guys have any feedback or comment down below please leave a like and subscribe as always you are updated to any every videos that we upload so now if you guys are interested in working with sociable kit and you want to try it out you can just go to the official website of Searchable Kit and from here we're going to click this pricing tab. So in here you can see all of our subscription plans and pricing. So we have the basic free plan. So this is our these are the features of the basic free plan. And the starter kit, the business kit, and the elite kit. So that is all. So you can pay annually that you can save 50% or manually or I mean monthly so if you guys have any questions feel free to reach out to us and we can arrange something that uh, we can help you organize or help you uh, get any subscription plan and that is all thank you guys for listening and I'll see you guys in the next one